Okay, folks. This is my bug out bag. It's a US Moldy 2 on a fourth generation frame. I've got it all laid out to show you how I organize it. On the belt, I've got a two liter canteen with a canteen straw. Issue map case uh, includes a signal mirror and a bear banger and a red flare and a pen flare for launching them. GPS and a case on the belt. My hatchet slash tomahawk, which is mounted on the outside. I got an improved first aid kit, including a cat tonic. The right-handed sustainment pouch is the kitchen, consisting of two bottles of fuel, a fire kit, in its own bag, stove kit in its own bag, including the stove itself, and a repair kit for general repairs. In the top flap of the pouch of the rucksack, I've got my mosquito net head net. I use an NBCW protective bag to hold all my clothes. It keeps all my clothes nice and dry even when the rucksack gets wet. I've got a field message pad for writing my thoughts. Water filter and shaving kit and towel and all this here goes into the main pouch. In the Claymore pouch I've got the six magazine bandolier. One magazine rack carries a repair kit for the Moly rucksack. The next one carries a wind-up lithium battery flashlight. The last one is bug spray and I got toilet paper and binos in the um, Claymore pouch itself. Over here to the left sustainment pouch and we got our accessories, we got our sewing, we got our sewing kit here. This is our camera accessories, rope for the odds and ends, my cup, good and nice plastic cup so it doesn't heat up too much when you get hot liquid in it, a headlamp, a BCB mess tin, this is a great mess tin, there's plenty of reviews on eBay about that. And the BCB kettle. This is a great little kettle. T for four. And that's how I've designed my rucksack. My next video I'll show the um, sleep and sustainment system. Out for now.